Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is Mr. Mocha Lover. Let's continue playing as the New California Republic. So, um, right now, we're taking a quick look at how whoever this is, the Murtaugh, are doing in their war against the Pharaohs. Actually, the Pharaohs. Probably fairly Egyptian under Thomas Allen, okay. Not a bunch of manpower for the Pharaohs, but for these guys, but a little bit less than the Pharaohs, but not still not too bad. Equal number of divisions. Very interesting. And the only way they're going to kill each other is through Twin Falls. So, very, very interesting. Already told my guys to move over there, sent some ranger companies. Um, what we want to do is stage an incident at the Sloan border. That's what I really want to annex Hidden Valley. I don't want to go to war with the Western Brotherhood, but, um, yeah. They're, right now, they are doing bro Brotherhood Expansion. Draw the Sword, Navarro or Nothing, Citadel of Steel. Eventually, if I'm at war with Kaiser's Legion and avoided reigniting the NCR Brotherhood War, this focus will be cancelled, huh? Recruitment Drive, Logistical Support. Oh, wow, mine is 50% Supply Consumption. Reinforcer, plus 30%. Holy cow. Nice. And Pico's Colony was annexed. This might be a bad idea for me trying to actually stage an incident here against these guys, but uh, we'll see what happens. You know, we'll see what happens. I need... Oh, we need more power armor, but we definitely need more guns. Scavenging options. Yeah, show standard missions, man. Yeah, we just need more guns. Which I am unfortunately out of at this moment. We have a lot of good extra stuff. But I'm not going to just take off other factories really for guns. Hmm. Do that. We've got supposedly excess planes, but not really. Guns. I don't want to take off pipe guns because they're really good. But, ah, screw it. We'll do it. Why not? Tra traditional instruction. Good. Resources are nice. Don't Not really need it at the moment, though. Engineering. Cool. How are, how are these guys doing? I think they're attacking. Which might be a bad idea for them. Since they don't have... They're not extremely strong, but they do, I guess, have some air support, so... I suppose it could be much, much worse. We're not doing a whole lot of damage either, but whatever. Damage done to enemy divisions. Probably not a lot. But they actually might be winning. Yeah, look at that. Oh, good. They got twin falls. Nice. Good job, guys. And finally, we're kind of in the battle... Right now, we are in an emergency situation in which we have just elected the military to take a no-nonsense approach to the situation in the north. So now we get a little more popular democracy, we lose a few civilian factories, and remove the spirit of Brahmin barons, which is good. Next up is military centers. Get outposts all up there, and I want to get to organized rationing for more population. Escalate to board conflict with these guys. We'll abort of interaction with them. Starts a border war between Prim and Sloan. Prim is... Oh, over here. Good, I have my rangers just over here, just in case as well. Right now, I gotta remember though. My infantry divisions, they're only 19 combat width. If I add on a machine... Ooh, I could add on power armor. That wouldn't really help us too much, actually. If we did that. More armor, more HP... That really doesn't give us that much armor anyways. But more machine brigades we'd lose. Actually, quite a bit. we lose organization. We would lose HP, which is not good. We would get more soft attack, but for that soft attack, eh, it's okay. I'd probably turn these into 40 with combat divisions maybe someday. Definitely not any day soon. Logistic companies could be really good, though. Supply use, supply usage. Oh, yeah. Oh, and definitely more HP. Oh, heck yeah. That's, that's not bad. Can I afford it? Oh, I can't afford it. Oh, oh, go ahead and just do that. That'd be good for us. All right, how's the battle in the north going? I think we're pretty much ready for this. Escalate this. Effect, effect when selected. Hmm, I think we got to get a pretty good number amount of soldiers here. Take you guys out. Throw you back to. Um, wait, Mossman, why are you over here? Um, honestly, as much as I love Mossman... Wait. Ah! You guys were moved around a little bit, so go ahead and take you guys back out. 
Well, I mean, with this... Oh, they, they actually have quite a few divisions around here. Come to, like, Searchlight and Nipton and, what's up, and stuff like that. That should be okay. We should be okay with attacking with our Rangers and whatnot first. Let's see what happens. Last time we tried this, it wasn't great. Um, you guys... You have both Rangers in here. That's not bad. And they're just dogpiling more soldiers on here, so I don't think I can really do anything. Yeah, that's pretty bad, actually. I need to be able to pierce the enemy a little bit more and more and more. Yep, it's going to fail again. Just because... They just kept stacking more soldiers. That's really kind of honestly unfair. If I can't stack more soldiers, why why do they get to stack more soldiers? That doesn't make sense. So we're not going to be able to attack them. That really, really sucks, but whatever. Things happen, you know. Mm. Basic laser. A more soft attack. That's pretty bad, honestly. Uh, let's see. Put you back. Wait, what? No, no, no. I want both. Come on. Do that. Move it over to Gordo Bet's back. Over there. Four divisions. Be thrown back on to... Is this Kimball? No, it's Hanlon. Hanlon. That's fine. Throw you guys back onto him as well. So, would like to take out this area, but I just can't. I mean, they just keep stacking more and more divisions over here, which is really stupid in my opinion. Pretty unfair if it's a border incident, but whatever. Um, ba -da -dum -bum -bum. Murtaugh. Still an emergency in the north, though. Pale folks declared war in Ruby Valley Refuge. Yeah, I mean, how do I get rid of these guys? I don't want them here. This is really pissing me off now. Because I can't do anything about about these guys because they can stack up more soldiers, which makes no sense. Uh, military centers. Outpost, nice. Brahmin Bill, more stability. Removes Baron's War. Monthly population, consumer goods, stability, war support. Alright, well, I'll see what happens. Not much is really happening, though, at the moment. Need more guns, more support equipment, of course. Motorized, we definitely need more, need more military factories. Oh, yeah, put you up here. That'll be good. Hmm, other than that, we're doing pretty well. What is Kaiser's Legion doing? The Bodeo Wells. Badulio Wells? Ah, adding production of water and reorganizing the ranchers so they get even more manpower. Kaiser's Legion is getting pretty large. Oh, they have a lot of divisions, but not a ton of manpower. Not as much as before. Lay the land. All right, all right. How's the north going? Well, nothing's happening. For the most part. These guys are trying to attack, but... Um, I hope you guys counterattack, just because I want a little bit of the action as well. They're out of manpower. That's not good. You guys have quite a bit of manpower now. That's not good. For Mauta, whatever this guy's name is. Brahmin Bill, great. You know, I could keep doing this, but it's basically worthless to do. I would need more anti-tank for me to actually do a good job here. And I don't have that, so... Maybe if I get my rangers back, I can stage it again, but I don't know. Because my rangers can pierce them, because they have anti-tank, but, you know. And now we'll get these states back as a core, and more monthly population. Oh, cool. Indigala has something, I guess. Alright, yeah. Advanced technology. They don't have a lot of manpower, which is good, but... Ugh, I need more roll attention about we really want to go to war with them. Let's see, tank designer, armor, reliability... Ship designer, well, armor is probably just slightly more important in this case. Alright. Very nice. Hmm. License production. Yeah. Not really anything I can really do here. NCR troopers. I could add anti tank support. Soft attack, hard attack. No piercing. Well, actually, yeah, you actually get more piercing from anti tank. That actually might be really good to add to these guys. Because you get more soft attack and hard attack. That You know what? Let's let's try that. You know what? Why not? Who knows who has power armor? If I had to beat up the Brotherhood with power armor, so be it. But we're going to need a lot of anti-tank now. Holy crap. Oh my goodness. we got some scavenged power armor, which is awesome. Add that up there. Do this. Organized rationing. Now we permanently get plus 10% more monthly population. Whew. That's good. That's good stuff. Alright, there's really no one else we can attack. Really kind of sucks until we get to assault on Hoover Dam. We built the 13. Sea Bear. Um, we haven't done the Boneyard yet. Securing the old city. 
funding the followers. All is good in the boneyard, which is really nice. I mean, a lot of this stuff is very nice. It's just I don't have very much I can do. Rangers lead the way. More recon. More Oh, more heart attack. That'd be awesome for what we're trying to do. I could get better, more infantry equipment, but I really want to get to Beacon of Democracy. So let's do that first, and then maybe go for more infantry equipment. Because even though we could really use some, we could really, really use some more stuff like that. Uh, go ahead and add on another military factory at the current time. That'd be great. Yeah, I definitely want more equipment. Not going to stage another incident at the Sloan border. That'd be a waste of time. So, yeah. Just make as many guns as possible. You see the 20. 30, I mean. 30. Oh, and we are getting attacked down here. Interesting. We have a lot of divisions down here, but obviously our guys that we're trying to help out, they're not doing so great. Not doing super, super great. We are slowly, slowly losing the battle. Research speed. Ooh, radar. Ooh, we get... Oh, yeah, I love radar. Oh, yeah, we're probably going to lose this battle. But it, it gives Julian Stevens, I guess, some much-needed experience, so... And we have been kicked out. Yep. All right, then, everyone, go ahead and pause. At least we're getting a little bit of action here. Oh, you were just defeated immediately. Holy crap. These guys are a little bit strong. Oh, yeah, they're definitely pushing. These guys are probably going to get taken over. That's pretty unfortunate. Oh, well, well, maybe not. Hold on. Wait. Wait just a second here. Our guys are running out of, quite literally, men and women to fight with. They're attacking, but they're not losing any men or women. Maybe they're on some sort of mobilization speed. I don't know. It's a higher mobilization. Anything else yet? Nope. All right. Radio. Nice. Better reinforce rate. More encryption sounds good to me. I keep throwing my guys back in here because I can actually support my guys. Oh my goodness. I'm losing a lot of manpower. Oh my goodness. Go and spread yourself out a little bit. How much mana have I lost? I've only lost 29. Why is my manpower so low? Oh, part of it, I mean, we did lose some core population, but... But there are cores once again... That's not good. I mean, I am trying to train a lot of divisions, though. I do have quite a few army... Not army, but, you know, divisions. Joe O'Malley, go ahead and send him onto here. That'd be great. Mercenary conscription. Better reinforce rate. Better leg recovery rate. Now we're going to get actually 5% more population. Ooh, that's good. That's good stuff. Because right now we're on 5.4%. Not bad. Not bad. Um, honestly, I think it'd probably be best if we situated ourselves like this, maybe. So we can defend. Maybe a little bit better. Refurbishing the power plant. That'd be good to do as well. Come on, man. I need a lot more guns than what you're just giving me right now. We're pretty good at machine guns. But regular guns? Ooh. Service rifles. We can wait for that for a little bit. Support companies. More piercing power actually would be really good. Heavy machine guns. Ooh. Land auctions we're doing well on. Air. I have forgot to do air for a little bit. Salvaged bomber. The range is just so good. What is the ground attack of these? It's a plane. Mm, air attack. D Wait. They don't have... These guys have a ground attack of nine. Oh, these are naval targeting things. Oh, these are strategic bombers. Okay. Yeah, I definitely want to do this one next. So, oh, oh, no. Let's go Savaged Fighters so we can get actually better fighters for now. Because while we have good fighters, they're just not as good, I suppose. They could be better. Things could always be better, but whatever. Um, military factories going on nicely. We're improving infrastructure down here so we can build more factories down here. And we're beginning to build more outposts in the areas that Kaiser's Legion could attack us. Cool. I have 150. Still nothing. So be it. What do I do here? More special forces. Oh, we can do All-American Badass. Division, Attack Corps, and Defense on core territory. Probably not Colonel Moore, just because War Support's... We're at max War Support. Planning speed's already pretty good. Uh, how many more Special Forces? It's only 2.5 more. That's not a whole bunch. And I'm allowed 130. I think we're okay on that. 
for right now, just to be sure about things. I know it's only on core areas, but this might help us quite a bit if we go with an All-American Badass. So let's do that. Invite anyone else to the faction? Nope, not yet. We are literally just waiting for them to attack us as this other guy is trying to get more manpower back. New Reno declared war on antelope tribes. Can I actually join your war? No, I can't. Darn, that sucks. Alright, well, good luck, guys. I hope you don't lose. I really hope you don't lose. New decisions. Polyalphabic ciphers. Nice, more encryption. More decryption sounds pretty good to me. Could use another research slot, though. You got a lot of naval XP. That's a lot. Oh, and our guys are trying to attack. I mean, if I try to help you attack, would that help at all? Our guys are in the battle, but... Yeah, go ahead and stop. That, that was a waste of time. You guys are just doing alright. Yeah, I can help out in the battle, but not really much is going on. You know what? I'm going to increase the amount of planes we can have here. That's fine. Increase the amount of close air support these guys have. That might help. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Oh, New Reno. They're doing okay. They're not winning in some areas, but they're winning in others. Very interesting. That... For some reason, I thought there was a nuke going off there. Ooh, they are attacking again. That's not good. Yeah, these guys are probably a lost cause, to be honest. They're not very good. Our close air support planes can only do so much, so... Yeah, don't worry about it, guys. We're here to get Julian Stevens some more XP, even though he is a harsh leader. Huh, I didn't know he was a harsh leader. Refurbishing the power plant. Finally, we can be a de beacon of democracy. Thank God, so we can get to civilian economy, less consumer goods needed, and we can actually build things a little bit faster. Awesome. Really awesome stuff. Still nothing. Cool. Frequency analysis, great. Happy 19... Happy 19? No. Happy 2279, guys. Uh, better research speed, yes please. God dang it. Man, they're just gonna... They're just gonna kill everyone here, so... There's really no good point to really keep on fighting for these guys. I mean, they're just going to keep losing and losing and losing and losing, so... And the war's pretty much over, right? They took this capital city. So, what happens now? I mean, they're just attacking with overwhelming forces. And trying to defend is nearly impossible with these rangers. Oh, uh, yeah, don't go over there. That's kind of crazy, Bill. That's alright, that's alright. You, you can't win every every war. Just don't lose the wars that you're currently fighting. Ah, New Reno's doing pretty well. That's good. That's good. Julian Stevens. You're holding on nicely for now. Oh, we probably lost all air support. That's okay. Come back down here, and go ahead and increase it to 100. Nice. Now we have... 93 to 89. Nice! We almost have a surplus of planes. That's really awesome. Yeah, these guys are pretty strong. I mean, one for one, they can't beat us for the most part, but... If it's not one to one... Ooh. I have to do that already. That'd be good. If they're adding in, like, four divisions against R1 and our allies' other crappy divisions, yeah. They're definitely going to win that battle. Um, Barons of the NCR. Hero of the Mojave. More population. Less division training time. The Old World Wall. Um, maybe? Rebuilding Long 15. R Riverbank Fortifications. Um, we'll, we'll do Riverbank Fortifications eventually. Port Eridesh. Port Eridesh. Barons of the NCR. More population. Um, civilian construction speed. These are all okay. They're not great. We'll go with Rangers for right now. Lead the way. 
Go ahead and go this way. Nice. We got even more free civilian factories. Just build as many of these things as you possibly can. That'll be good. Roll out technology to scavengers. Sure. Nice. And we're on civilian... Oh, we can go to partial mobilization once we have enough political power. That's great. That's really great. Finally. And we lost. Oh, well. Things happened. I tried my best. Didn't lose too many soldiers, so... But now we might be able to try something else here once we have those two divisions back with us. And actually... Why don't you guys come over here? You're going to do this area. Because our guys will need some ground support once we the battle starts cooking up. Alright. Go ahead and actually pull out some of these guys here. Just because they're going to clog up the area. Do that. Nice. These guys are back. Throw you guys onto him. Oh, NCR patrol report. Recently, NCR patrol found a large group of Brotherhood soldiers and scribes inhabiting a building in the heart of the Boneyard. Attempts to figure out what they're doing have been fruitless. When asked to leave, they declined violently. Already, a few NCR soldiers have died for trespassing, and we've reached a breaking point. Oh my gosh, I know nothing about this. Is this, this has got to be in the focus tree somewhere. Barons of the NCR, all's good in the Boneyard. Um, the Baron... The bear roars doesn't have anything to do with this, probably. Probably sending a messenger would be probably be the best. Does this affect the Brotherhood's focus tree as well? That's a good thing to ask. So, did they do a focus? Wow, 12% more recruitable population. Holy cow. Strip the sub. Develop the slums. Encourage civilian business, destroy hub ideology, curb raider aggression. I don't think they did. Old world focuses. All the construction, Maxon. No, I don't think they did. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think they did. Um, I'm just going to say send a messenger for now. Because I don't want to escalate the conflict between me and them. Even though I am trying to take over Sloan and this area, so... Yeah. Go ahead and prepare yourself to get the guys over here. Our messenger has come back to a shaken but unharmed. The message he carries from the Brotherhood is blunt and to the point. Our soldiers were acting without orders. They must have gone AWOL over something important. Whether we believe them or not, one thing is certain. The Brotherhood soldiers we found were in a West Tech factory. Extend an olive branch. We'll, tr we'll try our best to be friendly with the Brotherhood. We'll try our best. Because we believe in democracy, right? Yeah, that's why. Yeah. Nice. More monthly population growth. Good. It's better salvaged fighters. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Engineering. We've been doing a lot of good stuff in engineering. Ooh. Oh, that's too far ahead of time. Cap and growth. Is there anything that protect that I need? Um, let's get some anti-tank supporting piercing. Because we're going to need that against the Sloan guys. Scrap fighters. Yes, please. I think it's going well. Ballistics is going pretty well as well. Nice. Awesome. Can we... Oh, we can go to partial mobilization. Thank God. Oh my God, that's so many factories. Oh, it's so nasty. I love it. Keep building those outposts for now. That'll be good. You guys, go ahead and stop training. You never know what might happen here. So... But you guys actually have some anti-tank, so if we need to pierce the enemy's divisions, we might be able to. Definitely might. Um, New Reno is almost done with their war. That's pretty good. I'm sure they lost quite a few guys, though. Ooh. 807 guys compared to who they're fighting. Zero. Okay. I'm really interested to see, though, what has happened between me and the Brotherhood. Like... I'm not going to attack Sloan again until I have this extra piercing power, because I really need against power armor. Awesome. Rangers lead the way. More recon. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Barons of the NCR. More hard attack. Even more hard attack. 
feel that the Brotherhood of Steel are easily the most dangerous threat that the NCR faces to this date. Honestly, with what's happened recently, I'm going to do this as well, just because I don't know what they're going to do. So, And I guess since we're waiting right now, use power armor or vehicles to get more power armor or vehicles. Well, right now, I could really use anti-tank. That sounds more like equipment stuff, so... Um... 85% chance of equipment scavengers return. Let's do that. Get more equipment if we can. <clears throat> Alright, power... Ranger can openers. Love it. Next tech, please. It is 2279. A lot of wars have not happened. I mean, it's only 68% world tension. Kaiser, how's Kaiser doing? It's been a little bit of time since I've explored them and what they've been doing. Gaius Magnus. Oh, no. That doesn't... It's legendary Grit. Oh, baby. Oh, Gaius Magnus becomes the unit leader. Modern military. Legion Reborn. Wait, they get basic power armor? Infantry, soft attack, and breakthrough? Oh, my goodness. Now, they're going to eventually use Foundries of Mars. Great War... T oh, my goodness. Oh, man. I'm going to need more piercing power then. Oh, boy. So... Has anything happened at all between me and the Brotherhood? Like, I'm kind of still just waiting to see what happens, but it seems like nothing's really going on. Can I add any more divisions? 131. If I double everything that I have now, that actually might be okay, but I don't want the supplies to be... Okay, that's not bad. What if I doubled all of my spec ops? Now, I know this is probably terrible. Like, I should probably be adding, honestly, on... Of, like machine guns, but I want to see. I want to see what this will turn into. Forty combat with nothing but spec ops. Three hundred. Look at that HP. Look at the organization isn't bad either. Tons of recon, suppression, breakthrough, defense. I'm gonna try this. This is probably an absolutely terrible thing to do. Absolutely terrible. But this might be needed for me to actually pierce the enemy's armor. Nice civilian draft. Less, less organization, but more population. Now we get even more recon, and then soft attack. Good. More free civilian factories. Good, good, good. Oh, man, just in case. I don't know how the Brotherhood's going to react to me. Just keep building factories for now. Just keep building factories, because I'm going to need a ton of factories. More, A lot more anti-tank. A lot of uh, motorcycles, pip guns, stuff like that. Just keep building, building, building. We're going to have a, one hell of a juggernaut war machine here eventually. God, you guys cannot really take Danio. Holy cow. Complicated circuitry. Nice. Better research speeds. Ooh, we can build radar. I love radar so much, man. If we could build one of those, like, here, that could potentially pay off. Outposts. Nice. Very nice. Unpredictable attacks. Good. Even more piercing. You know what? I'm going to go with an improved anti-tank launcher. I want as much piercing as humanly possible. Because even our infantry has some degree of piercing now. 15. Not bad. I mean, they aren't having all the armor that they need or the, all the equipment that they could use. But we'll see what happens. I really want to know how much armor these guys have, though. <sighs> these guys are almost ready to fight. Most of them. HP 654. Ah, oh, there we go. We got even 50% more heart, heart attack. Oh, yes, please. That's awesome. Um, we're almost done with this. Gun runners, reliability, soft attack, mechanized. Let's go with Hero of Mojave. Let's do that. Let's see what happens with this. And it looks like we're good to go. Ooh, service rifle's done. I think we're getting into a better and better position for us overall. The amount of infantry we're making is slowing down a little bit, but overall, I think this is going fairly decently. If it's not going fairly decently, according to you, let me know in the comments below, but that's pretty much it that we've got for today. With that in mind, guys, there's a lot of just doing, you know, research and focus trees and exploring our relationship with the, ENS, with the uh, Brotherhood of Steel. But we'll see what happens next time, guys. With that in mind, thank you very much for watching. Next time we will do another incident here in the Western chapter. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow as we explore our possibilities. Thanks for watching, guys.